Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. So today's video we are doing one that I've done a couple of times before, I can't remember. I know I've done it once or twice. Uh, we're doing a what I eat in a week for breakfast. Like I say, I know I've done it before, but I think it's why. It's like what I eat in a day. It's, it's, it's ones that they just never get old, do they? You know, I always say it, but if you guys are stuck in a little rut, then so am I, so you're not really in the right place to get amazing content. But <laughs> before you switch off, you'll still enjoy it. So yeah, I hope you guys do enjoy this one. If you do, please don't forget to give it a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you're new here. But let's get straight into it as I've got my first breakfast sat here. So it's Monday morning, late morning actually, may I say. So I'm not having too much. And to be fair, it's not looking great. So actually so i'm actually having one of these slim fast porridge i'm not on slim fast the only reason i'm having this is because i did a slim fast video a few weeks ago and in that video i had some of this as well as the shakes so this is slim fast golden syrup flavor porridge i fancy porridge anyway and i forgot that i had that so i thought you know what why not so yeah it's looking a little bit stodgy and that's not the fault of the porridge it's the fault of the chef i'm the chef uh but <laughs> Yeah, and the only reason I've done that is just because, you know, it's easier. It, why why would you cook your own when you've got a packet mix? I'm going to treat myself and put some chocolate in there. I forgot that I had these. These are in my cupboard. I went and got my water bottle out this morning. I was like, oh, but I had him. It's a little white reindeer. It is a reindeer, yeah. From Hotel Chocolat. So I'm going to have one of them. Pop him on top. And uh, Bob's your uncle. I don't know why he just barks then. Maybe he doesn't like Bob. Anyway, let's have a little bit. Whilst that melts, let's have a little bit of the side bit. As unappetising that, as that looks, it does taste very good. It's got a real good amount of golden syrup in there. Like the flavour of it is just, you know, lovely. And to be fair, I was when I was upstairs, I was thinking that I was going to have porridge, put golden syrup on and put a little Mr. Reindeer on. So, you know, two birds on stone, have out a packet. He's not quite melted enough yet. I don't know why I fancy uh, porridge on a summer's day, although today it's a little bit cloudy. So, you know, but I feel like porridge is more like wintry sort of thing. Anyway, I think it's gonna take a little while to fully melt, he's still solid. I'm gonna go back upstairs. Do a bit more work. Sorry, I, I'm talking to you whilst kind of cleaning up my mess around me. Do some more work. I'm actually on a half day of work from work today, which is fab. Although, don't know why I let you guys know that because we're only having dessert and no, we're not, we're having breakfast. So yeah, I will see you tomorrow, Tuesday, for some more breakfast. Good morning, happy Tuesday. So for breakfast this morning, I'm gonna be having some cookie crisp. If I look tired, I just want to say I am. I'm really tired. I didn't really... I feel like I missed out on quite a few hours of sleep. I had a few drinks on Saturday night and woke up Sunday just... I don't know, you know when you drink and you feel like you just missed out on basically a whole night's sleep? Even though I got to bed like a normal time. I feel tired. So if I look tired, I am tired. Uh, anyway, I'm having some cereal. Breakfast, as I just told you. And I actually wanted to ask you, people that have a dishwasher, what am I doing wrong with my dishwasher, right? So every so often, it doesn't happen every time, but when I wash everything and deload, unload, <laughs> unload my dishwasher, sometimes it's still, some of the bits come out dirty and it's not like I'm, sorry, this is probably really boring for the majority of people. It's not like I am putting, I don't know, say I cook like a, I don't know, like a pasta bake and you get all the, all the bits still on it. It's not coming out like that. It's basically, so most things are quite clean, not clean, whatever. It, it, it needs to be cleaned and it's not coming out that clean. Some of the things have like, it's mainly my bowls that are on the top, the bits that are on the top. They have like red sort of, I don't know. It's, it looks like tomatoey stuff, but I haven't really been eating tomatoey stuff. I don't know what I'm trying to say, but can someone help me? What am I doing wrong? Is it that I'm not using expensive enough dishwasher tablets? Every time I unload it, I wipe down the 
what's it called the door and a couple of weeks ago i cleaned it with some dishwasher cleaner that have like a really nice hot cycle and it's still doing it so do i just need to spend a bit more money on dishwasher tablets please let me know because it's really annoying i just had to wash up a load of bowls that have come out and a saucepan like and it's not in the the saucepan that you would cook in it's on the other side of it it's on the bottom of the saucepan which has been facing up so something's wrong please help anyway i'm gonna go finish this and i will see you tomorrow please let me know what i need to do i honestly think that sometimes breakfast is the hardest choice of the day because usually dinner you've already decided like beginning of the week what you're going to be having lunch i'm a same type of guy gal so same type of thing person whatever <sighs> choosing breakfast i'm just like there's endless choices but also not endless choices do you know what i mean i really want a croissant but i don't have any <sighs> i think i'm gonna have to have some cereal again you know what the other ce the cereal i actually want is weetabix and i don't have any the only reason i want that is because i've seen an advert this morning on the tv about weetabix so i'm like mm. I want some weed picks. But I'm gonna go with this nice quick mix. It's uh it's quite nice to be fair. A nice little sweet breakfast. So I think I've had it with you guys before. I'm pretty sure I have. It's white chocolate and regular chocolate little balls. So I'm gonna have that. Nice little little breakfast actually because I don't want too much for breakfast because tonight I'm gonna have a McDonald's for dinner. So you know, you've got to set up the rest of your day ready to have the McDonald's. I'm having McDonald's because hopefully by the time you see this, the video, I already would have done the video. Fingers crossed. For Sunday's video, this Sunday for me, but probably Sunday just gone for you by the time this goes up. Yeah, it will be. Um, because they've got some new food. So me and Josh are gonna go have a little midweek Mackey's. But the new food comes out today and it's always a little bit of a worry that they, I don't know, they haven't got it all. And one of them is McFlurry. Is it going to be the fact that we get to the front of the order, the queue and they say, yeah, the McFlurry machine's not working. What do you reckon? Well, you guys already know by the time we see this. So you're basically one step ahead of me. Anyway, I'm going to have this. And yeah, that's what I'm going to have. <laughs> don't know what I was going to say. So usual there's no point in me sitting and eating it with you because it's just cereal i don't really have anything else to talk about so i will see you tomorrow i wonder I'll see you tomorrow i've actually got to go to tesco's or a shop asda maybe at some point today so shall i pick up some croissants i might get some frozen ones actually because then i can have them whenever i want we'll see who knows good morning it is thursday the sun is shining and it's my last day of work this week what more can you want and this time for breakfast i didn't get some croissants like i said to you that i was gonna try and get yesterday to be fair i forgot about it my bad um sorry <laughs> i'm concentrating because the toast is just underneath you i'm gonna have some toast this morning what i'm gonna have on that toast though is the real question Hmm. Biscoff, I forgot I had that. Biscoff crunchy. Is it still in day? Yes. Let's have Biscoff for breakfast. Oh, I forgot to put the toast down. <laughs> ah. Anyway, how are you guys? Can you tell... Sorry, you're sat in the cupboard. Can you tell that I'm in a good mood because no more work after day? It's only one day. Literally the Friday that I'm off, but... It just makes life better, doesn't it? I've got tomorrow off because it's Josh's birthday. And yesterday I did manage to film, as you would have seen already, the, uh, what's it called? McDonald's one. And I had McDonald's last night, actually. Uh, I had Biscoff last night in the McFlurry. It was a little bit of a letdown because I've seen loads of different videos of people's uh, photos, not loads, that's a bit of an overreaction. Mm -hmm. But I've seen quite a few different photos of people's someone at my door sorry i thought there was someone at my door and now it's gone really dark i have a ring doorbell and i don't know about anyone else i'm sidetracking now but when 
it's really sunny my ring doorbell is really sensitive and if a car drives past or a little mouse walks past i don't have mice but you know that's the only thing that come to my brain it goes off and it is so annoying so it just went off then and there's no one there anyway um yeah what's i saying the mcflurry that i've seen there's loads of loads of people keep putting photos on of the biscoff mcflurry and they've got loads of the biscoff like biscuity bits on top come on and i didn't have that they spread all of it in for me which was good but i wanted a load of it you know it was like an Instagram versus reality type thing, but it was still good. So I'd recommend getting that if you haven't already had it. I forgot I even had this. I've got my, I need to change it in my cupboard because I've got all my spreads like this, jam, marmite on a little Lazy Susan. And this wasn't facing the front, the marmite was. So I need to change it so I can finish this off because look how much is in there. Anyway, I've been chatting for five minutes. Obviously I probably will cut that down, but Five minutes just to tell you what I'm having breakfast. So, Biscoff on toast with me this morning. What are you guys having? I'll see you tomorrow. Good morning. Happy Friday. I'm absolutely starving. I've been up, I was about to say, I feel like, feel like I've been up for hours. I have been up for hours. My alarm went off this morning at six o'clock. I'm not working today, but Josh, so it's Josh's birthday today and he's working a half day. His work messed up with holidays or whatever. So, he was up at six he's back home in literally he finished it at 11 it's five to 11 but i thought i can't just stay in bed whilst he's getting up and going to work on his birthday and it's his 30th so yeah i got with him and i just obviously can't eat straight away then i had loads of stuff to do had to go and drop sid off at my parents because we're off out tonight so yeah i'm only just about to have some breakfast and i'm gonna have a tiny bit of toast with biscoff again i'm gonna do it in a sec but there's no point in kind of doing it on camera because I'm telling you what i'm gonna have don't need to prove it I hope that you believe me. I just thought I'd you, show you our little setup. So obviously when he went to work this morning, it wasn't like this. But, you know, you've got to have a little birthday display. I couldn't think of the word. So obviously it's not all of his presents. These sort of ones here that are all the same wrapping paper are all from me. And then he's got his sister. He's got him stuff. My parents. My sister. And this little hamper of all his favourite bits from... Clearly, Sid, with a very strange looking paw print, but you know, don't don't judge me on that. But um, anyway, this video isn't about his birthday, but yeah, I, would, I just thought I would show you that. But the reason I'm gonna have only something small, even though I'm hungry, is because tonight we're going obviously out for dinner and we're gonna have like a, a bigger lunch, not too big, but in a bit when he gets back. So yeah, I only want something little, literally just to tie me over. Anyway, that's what I'm gonna have. Biscoff on toast. So, I will see you in the morning. It was all yellow. Morning. Happy Sunday. It's not Saturday. Sorry, you're in the cupboard, so you can see this. It's not Saturday. I... You're probably wondering why I missed Saturday. I didn't actually have any breakfast yesterday. It's my dad's birthday. So, it's Josh's birthday Friday. It's my dad's birthday on Monday, and we had a little party yesterday, and I had to get over there. Hang on, I just need to check on my toast. Good timing. Uh, I had to get over there and start setting up. So I kind of got up, got ready, just didn't have time to have breakfast. So you didn't miss anything. We didn't have any breakfast. So this morning, Sunday morning, and I am making myself some scrambled egg on toast whilst listening. It's a little bit of music. What else do you want on a Sunday morning? I was trying to get Harry Styles to play on the Alexa, but she wasn't doing it. She was playing Coldplay instead. But yeah. Just made myself some scrambled egg. I am just going to chill for today. I think I've got a bit of stuff to do in the garden. That is my breakfast. I'm going to put a bit of ketchup on there. It's not just going to be a complete beige breakfast. Uh, but yeah, that is the end of today's video. I hope you guys have enjoyed this one. I think it's literally just my breakfast, but you know. Why not? I hope it's something you want to see. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, please don't forget to smash a big thumbs up and subscribe if you're new to my channel. But that's all for now. So thank you again and I will see you in my next video.